The set of slides is about the international sector and in this presentation we'll explain direct and indirect quoting of exchange rates. So what are exchange rates? Foreign trade involves payment in foreign currencies. South African importers have to pay for their products in foreign currencies, while importers in other countries need South African rands to pay for their imports from South Africa. So if you want to import a car from Germany, you have to buy the car in Euro because that is the currency used in Germany, which means you have a demand for Euro. If Americans want to visit South Africa, they come with their dollars and they have to buy rands in exchange for their dollars to pay for the South African visit. In other words, they supply dollars in exchange for rand. So the exchange rate is the amount of one currency you need in order to buy another. And the market where currencies are traded for one another is called the foreign exchange market. The price of one currency in this foreign exchange market is always quoted in terms of another currency. A decrease in the value of rands in terms of dollars automatically translates to an increase in the value of dollars. So a decrease in the value of a currency is called a depreciation and an increase in the value of a currency is called an appreciation. So assume one dollar costs 10 rand. That is the rand dollar exchange rate. So one dollar equals 10 rand. Now the exchange rate changes to one dollar equals 11 rand. It means the rand depreciates it against the dollar. The dollar became more expensive. In other words, you need more rands to purchase one dollar than previously when the exchange rate was one dollar equals ten rand. At the same time this means that the dollar, dollar has appreciated against the rand. So if the exchange rate is one rand equals one dollar equals ten rand the price of one rand in terms of a dollar can be calculated. So we want to know the price of one rand, so we have to divide by 10. 10 divided by 10 gives us 1. But we have to do the same on the other side, also divide by 10. So 1 dollar divided by 10 gives us 0, 0,1 or 10 American cents is equal to 10 divided by 10. 1 rand. So 10 American cents equals 1 rand. Then the exchange rate changed to 1 dollar equals 11 rand. Now we can calculate the price of rand in terms of dollar by dividing by 11 on both sides. So that means 1 divided by 11 is 0, 0,09 so 9 American cents is equal to 11 divided by 11, 1 rand. So this means the dollar appreciated against the rand. You now need less dollar, only 9 cents instead of 10 cents, to buy 1 rand. So these are direct quotes. They tell us what the price of dollars is in terms of the local currency. So what one dollar will cost you to purchase. These are indirect quotes. They tell us what one rand of the local currency will cost in terms of the foreign currency. So direct quotes, indirect quotes. So what will determine these exchange rates? We will consider that in the next presentation. 
So in this presentation, we explained what an exchange rate is, we explained direct and indirect quotes, and we explained a depreciation and an appreciation of a currency.